Hey everyone, and welcome back to the channel. Today's code is PO304, which means cylinder number for in your engine is misfiring. This can cause rough idling, reduced power, and even worse gas mileage. Don't worry, though. In this video, we'll go through some simple steps to diagnose and potentially fix the problem ourselves. A misfire happens when the air-fuel mixture in a cylinder doesn't ignite properly. There are several reasons this might occur, but we'll focus on the most common culprits, spark plugs, ignition coils, and vacuum leaks. Before we begin, remember, this video is for informational purposes only. If you're not comfortable working on your car, it's always best to consult a mechanic. Also, consult your car's manual for specific locations of parts and any safety instructions. Tools you'll need. Basic socket wrench set. Spark plug gapping tool optional. Replacement spark plugs check your owner's manual for the right type. Screwdriver optional. Flashlight. The PO30 for code points to a misfire in cylinder 4, but there are a few culprits. Spark plugs, these are the most common cause. Worn or fouled spark plugs can prevent proper ignition. Ignition coil, the coil delivers the high voltage spark to the plugs. A faulty coil for cylinder for can cause misfires. Vacuum leaks, air leaks can mess up the air fuel mixture, causing a misfire. Look for loose or cracked hoses around the intake manifold. Locate your spark plugs, they'll be screwed into the engine block, usually with wires or coal packs on top. Consult your manual for cylinder 4's location. Disconnect the battery for safety. Remove the spark plug wire or coal pack from cylinder 4. Use a spark plug wrench to remove the spark plug itself. Inspect the spark plug, look for cracks, excessive wear, or fouling dark buildup. Gap the spark plug if necessary using a gapping tool refer to your manual for the correct gap. Replace the spark plug with a new one following the manufacturer's recommendations. Repeat steps 3 to 7 for all spark plugs. It's best to replace them all at once since they wear together. Some coals are easy to swap between cylinders. If possible, Switch the coal from cylinder for to another one. If the misfire code jumps to the new cylinder, the coal is likely bad. Warning: Some coals require specialized tools to remove. If you're unsure, consult a mechanic. Clean replace the faulty coal if needed. With the engine running, listen for hissing sounds around the intake manifold. You can also use a spray bottle with soapy water. Spray suspected leak areas, bubbles indicate a leak. Once you've replaced the faulty part, clear the trouble coat. You can do this with a scan tool or by disconnecting the battery for a short period refer to your manual for the exact method. Start the engine and see if the code returns. By following these steps, you should be able to diagnose and fix the PO30 for code in your car. Remember, if you're not comfortable with any of these procedures, don't hesitate to take your car to a trusted mechanic. Thanks for joining me today. If you have any questions about PO30 for codes or engine misfires, leave a comment below. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more car care videos.